Hey YouTube, it's Scribble Fox. Just a little math thing that I'm doing. So today I'm just going to be talking about cones and finding the volume of cones. Now, such as this ice cream cone has ice cream inside, the cone, the cone beside me, has units, units cube inside. That's how much volume is inside of it, how much air or how much anything you can put inside a shape. When measuring these units, you would use units cubed, which is represented by a number, and then a little three to represent how it's cubed. Now, how do we find the volume of this kind of shape? Really, the answer is quite simple. There's a simple mathematical equation for this cone. V, volume, equals one-third the area of the base times the height. Let's say that the radius of the base is 4 and the cone is approximately 6 units high. Now we all know how to find the area of the base. It's just a simple circle. The area of a circle is area equals radius squared times pi. Once you have that, you need to multiply it times the height. So if the base area is similar to 50 and the height is 6, we're still quite not done yet. We need to remember that one-third. Think of it as the B and the H, or just the first two parts of the equation. Think of a cone just like a cylinder. A cylinder and a cone with a similar base, the cone would be approximately one-third the volume of the cylinder. If the volume of a cylinder is 300, 300 divided by 3 is 100 units cubed. Those 100 units would be the volume of your cone. Anyway, this is a Scribble Fox education video. Hope you like it. Subscribe for more coolness. Bye.